Praise be to Jesus. Today's Gospel and Reflection The Holy Gospel according to St. John chapter 10 verses 31 to 42 The Jews then picked up stones to throw at him. So Jesus said, I have openly done many good works among you, which the Father gave me to do. For which of this are you stoning me? The Jews answered, We are not stoning you for doing a good work, but for blasphemy. You are only a man and you are making yourself God. Every nation issues identity cards for its citizens. It is required for the same moment in any part of the country. In today's Gospel, we find the Jews asking Jesus about the identity. Jesus came to the world with all the love of the Father. His mission was to make this love known to his children. But the people did not accept and respect Jesus. Everywhere rejection and humiliation welcomed him. The people showed so much of disrespect that they even started taking stones to throw at Jesus. The Son of God had to face such a gruesome act. It is worth inspiring to note the way in which Jesus encountered the Jews who showed so much of anger against Jesus. He in fact challenged them to forgo their evil ways and come back to the true path. Jesus always worked for the salvation of souls as it is said, I have not lost one of those you gave me. John 18, 9 The patience and the courage in speaking to the Jews is worth reflected. The fault which they found in Jesus was that he claimed himself as the Son of God, which is the plain reality. They rejected the anointed and sent by the Father. A person is understood as per his words and deeds. Jesus made it very clear to see whether his words and actions prove his identity as the son of the father. When Jesus said, the father and I are one, they could not just digest it because they considered him as one among them. Jesus had to flee from the place as the situation became worse. Why did Jesus face such opposition from the Jews? The answer is very simple because they had their own hidden agendas and they were not open to the Spirit to believe that Jesus was the Messiah who came to save everyone. Jesus overcame the situation with wisdom and the Spirit of the Lord. We do face similar situations Sometimes we have to prove our identity. At times we find our identity proof does not work at all. As we see around, Jesus inspires us to walk the talk. When we face rejection and humiliation, we need to follow the spirit of Jesus. We need to continue the good work we do and move forward to other areas so that the kingdom of God may be spread through our words and deeds. The Lord who is the source of inspiration will give us the courage and the grace to follow the path of the Lord. Amen.